watched my other video, we dragged my three wheeler out of this spot right here. But what also is sitting in here is this tractor. It's a 1980s John Deere 130. From day one, it had a custom dirt slash snow plow on it. And it, we do have the mower deck at home. Five speed transaxle. And I did have that weight custom made, as you can see, on the back for grip. This tractor has a nine horsepower Kawasaki engine. And it runs, I'm not going to start it because it hasn't been running since November 08, but it is running very rich. The carb is all in adjustment, like proper adjustment, but every once in a while it puffs out a lot of black smoke and fouls a plug every time we use it. So, we don't know what's going on, but we do think gas is getting into the crankcase by some kind of cracked diaphragm in there, I don't know. And then it's a nice tractor, it can push quite a bit of sand, since it's kind of hard to see, but this mound here in summer, I pushed up, and same with that one, you can't really see it in the video, obviously, but yeah. And then, this garage, I want to turn it into, I want to make it completely, like, a fully operational garage where you have all your tools and lighting and keep my Sears tractors in here and we have that trailer there with a wheelbarrow in it that trailer is very handy and uh I guess that's about it if anyone would like to see some more videos of this thing soon <coughs> it'll be about a month probably because it's a beautiful March day <coughs> in Manitoba, about, I'd say about plus 10-ish, but there, as you can see there's still a lot of snow on the ground. And this thing has a flat tire there, because in our yard somewhere, since we bought this house and there's a whole bunch of cars and stuff, there's got to be nails around somewhere in this yard or in here that's giving us flats. We've had two flats on my dad's TRX 200 SX, two flats on my three-wheeler, a flat on this. Luckily, no flats on the cars yet, or truck. But, yeah, that's about it. That's my John Deere OHV 130 Kawasaki. It does need a paint job. That's faded because it's been sitting outside for two years. And cracking paint. So once again, that's my John Deere OHV 130.